Hello everyone and welcome to a new tutorial from Garden of Design. Today we are making these um, felt table accessories. And here the machine already started. We are making the contour line on the stabilizer. And we add a piece of felt over it. And then the machine will do a second uh, contour stitch to make sure that everything stays in place. And when all this is done, the machine will also do uh, placing stitches for uh, appliques. The first one is the inner circle. And then we place a piece of fabric over it and we run the stitch again to keep it in place. And uh, after this is done, we take it uh, out. We take the hoop out. We do not take it out of the hoop. Just uh, the hoop out from the machine and we cut around for the applique. But if you want to optimize your... Uh, work you can leave it there and uh, do the stitch for the middle and add uh, the piece of fabric for the middle of the design and if you want you can also just uh, skip this part altogether and do not do applique just do the stitches but uh, the design is intended to do with applique so here you can see we cut around the middle and uh, the outer circle so uh, now it will start the decorative embroidery first it will do this uh, flower in the middle and then it will move on to uh, the other decorative stitching for this design. All the design in this series are done in the same way and if you want to make uh, the coaster you will have to make only the part in the middle so this uh, purple flower and its middle will be uh, the coaster and if you want to make the bigger version it is big enough so you can um, put it under a plate. And here you can see after all the decorative stitching is done, we added a piece of felt on the back and we taped it in place so it does not move. And we return the hoop to the machine for the outer contour. This uh, stitch will uh, keep in place the felt on the back of the hoop. And after this is done, the machine will um, move on and uh, see the back of the hoop and now it will move on to do the setting stitch all around the design if you wish you can uh, trim your design now and uh, if you use uh, water soluble stabilizer then you will have um, you will, will not have to cut it out at the end we chose to leave it here and do the setting stitch and you will see uh, that we did the cutting out at the end so both ways are uh, with great results so if you want uh, your setting to be the edge then you can use water soluble stabilizer and before this step you just have to cut around like just like it's an applique so you will cut around on top and on the back and if you do that um, and you want it to look pretty you should use the same color of thread for the bottom as for the top and here you can see it is uh, done with the outer layer for the flowers and it will do the circle covering the edges of the first applique
this is such a pretty design and you can use all your uh, um, cotton fabrics so um, you can make all this amazing um, um, plate mats and uh, coasters and uh, if you make uh, more um, of these designs and you use coordinating colors you can even stitch them together for a table runner how's that for a great idea so i am so excited to see what you make with these designs here you can see us cutting out the flower so you can use them as creatively as you as you wish you can uh, even use them as um, um, Christmas tree decorations or you can make a spring wreath with them. All depending on the colors you choose and uh, what you want to do with them. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and you like uh, these designs. Don't forget to like and share. Bye!